For the winner of a fight, the rewards are substantial. For the loser, there will be nothing but disgrace. Each fighter has promised to reward the gods if he wins. Thai boxers who win their fights often visit Buddhist shrines the next morning to give thanks. They believe the ancient spirits interceded to help them. Those who won big money like to show their gratitude, not just with offerings, but by sponsoring a special dance for the gods. This is one of the very few areas of modern life to which the classical Thai arts have any relevance today. Their rigid disciplines and slow formal gestures are out of step with contemporary Thailand. Though strenuously promoted by our government agencies as Thailand's living classical culture, they have little or no place in the lives of most Thais today. These girls, like the boxers who paid for them, come from poor families who saw classical dance as a way out of the ghetto. ตั้งเดิมผมความจริงตัวผมไม่สบายเป็นโรคเบาหวานไม่สามารถที่จะประกอบอาชีพได้ก็เลยให้ลูกหัดลําแล้วก็เลยเป็นละครครับแล้วอ
At Luk Tung talent shows, girls of every age hope to be discovered. If your song's good or bad enough to be distinctive, you might find yourself a fairground entertainer in some provincial city. Hopeful Luk Tung stars use their songs to introduce daredevil acts in the desperate search for fame or wealth. One step nearer stardom takes country girls into the travelling Luk Tung troupe